Hi everyone, it's Danny from Orchid Nature. So today I'm going to show you how to remove a keiki from a dendrobium orchid cane. Now I'm here repotting my dendrobium orchid. As you can see, it has a lot of new growths. Um, the flowers are done, so it's time to repot this orchid. Now I do prefer dendrobiums with these type of growths. They just look prettier, but this one has produced a keiki on the mother plant here, as you can see. Personally, I don't like these keikis to stay on the plant, so for whatever reason you want to remove this keiki from the mother plant, I'll just show you how to do it. Now there are many ways to remove this keiki. Some people like to use a knife, but I personally like to twist the keiki out of uh, the mother cane here. It's really easy. What you want to do is actually keep the roots of the keiki, so try to not damage these roots. And also if you see that the keiki has a new growth, try to be gentle with it. I would have preferred this keiki not to have the growth, but I'll do my best to remove it. So what you want to do is grab the keiki by the base. You don't want to grab it from here because it might snap along the way. Grab it as close to the base as possible and then just twist it. You can twist it a few times, usually it doesn't come off from the first twist. And there you go, you have a dendrobium cake you removed which you can pot it up separately now. Keep in mind that this keiki on its own will develop slower than if it were to stay on the mother cane because it has to tend for its own now, it has to provide um, for its own, the roots need to develop more, um, it will not be supported by the mother cane. I personally will pot this little keiki along with the mother plant um, just because I want a bushier orchid. Now on the wound here, you can place a bit of cinnamon uh, or a bit of uh, wax to sterilize it and to keep it from getting infections. I will not use anything, I don't think I will get any infections. This wound will scar, will dry up and everything will be okay. So thank you for watching this video, I hope you found it interesting. And if you want to see other videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you want to get in touch with us and show us your uh, orchid photographs or share your stories with us, visit orchidnature.com. So if you have any other questions, just pop them in a comment and I'll try to answer for you. I'll see you next time. Bye!